I think it's going to take what we've been trying to do for the last few games, putting two halves together. Uh, we had a great first half uh, the other night. Second half, we didn't come out with as much energy as Colorado did. You know, they, they came out uh, fighting. And I think if we just put two halves together, it's going to help us and put us in a position to be successful. Brandon, does, does this uh, Miami team remind you of anybody that you played this year? Um, you know, they have a lot of height. I think they're probably the biggest team we played this year. But, you know, we played a lot of tough games. So, I mean, I think we're really prepared for this game. You know, the coaches are going to have a great plan for us, you know, uh, coming in. And as long as we execute and, uh, you know, uh, we, we conserve our energy, or we don't conserve our energy, we just lay it on the court, put it all on defense as well as offense, it's going to help us. From what you've seen of Larkin, is he kind of the real deal? Is he as good as advertised? Yeah, I mean, the kids, he's a player, you know. Uh, He's pretty much ahead of the snake for that team. Tracy, you know, DJ. The guys look for them to do a lot of things. So you know, I'm looking forward to the challenge. You know, we're, I think as a team, we're going to be ready to, to defend them. We played against you know guards of his caliber you know, all season. As you watch teams like Florida go to the South, full upsets, does that just give you more confidence? Or? I mean, not really. Uh, when you get in the tournament, it doesn't matter what seed you are. It doesn't matter you know what your, your background is. You're 0-0 zero, zero starting the tournament. So anything can happen. I think a lot of teams forget you know, the things we've done this season. So. You know, yep. just coming in as an underdog, it gives us a lot more confidence.